What's going on, homies? Welcome to the first episode of Madden. Now, today we're going to be making a halfback, and I'm going to put him on for the Falcons. Now, this is basically just going to be a voiceover because I did record my voice during this, but it's just like the gameplay just delayed itself multiple times, and my computer is such bullshit that I'm just going to start doing voiceovers for my Madden, and I'll find a way around these uh, these little glitches with my computer. Sometimes before, or sometime, or during Christmas or before Christmas, I am going to have to deal with these issues. Uh, the problem is, I'm well, the thing is, I'm going be getting a new pc during christmas so it should be a lot better after christmas time so we're just gonna be half back his name's gonna be jake thompson he's gonna be around like 240 pounds or something like that i can't remember off the top of my head it's gonna be like 6'3 maybe if i'm getting this right on i'm fucking amazing he's gonna play for the falcons uh i don't know how their o-line is necessarily but hopefully they're really really good our first game is against the bears at soldier field so we're just gonna hop right into it our first player of our career consists of a nine and a half year yard run by your boy Jake Thompson you know I feel like we're gonna have a, an absolutely phenomenal career and uh, this is just the start of it a few uneventful plays later we are now in the red zone and Matt Ryan connects a 14 yard pass with one of our wide receivers and now we are inside of the one yard line and since I'm a greedy son of a bitch I just wanted to punch this thing in and we get our first touchdown of our career a one yard uh, rush by our boy Jake Thompson for the touchdown we are now up six zip on the first play of the new possession we get around a one yard rush running to the right the bears are not able to score on their possession so we are still up seven zip two plays later matt ryan has an incomplete pass down the middle of the field and now it is fourth down the next possession we get our first reception and we are now up by only four Now being third down and nine, Matt Ryan decides to pass it completely nowhere near me. Actually, it kind of was, but my, my guy didn't even like attempt to catch it. He could have tried to possess and catch it, but he didn't give two fucks. So now it's fourth down. We are now down three in this game as Matt Ryan throws the ball down the middle as we get a first and a little bit more. We're not at the 25 yard line of Matt Ryan makes another great throw down the middle to get us in the red zone. Three different routes and that was it. Now you can run anything and catch the balls we just saw there. And down inside the 15 he goes. It is now second and six and Matt Ryan makes an amazing pass to one of our wide receivers for the touchdown. We are now up 14-10. At the final play of the half, Matt Ryan decides to throw a Hail Mary and it's intercepted by Prince Amukamara. I think that's how you say it. And now at the end of the half, the score is 17 to 14 Bears. On the first play of our possession on the second half, Jake Thompson gets a two yard run to the right side and the Bears also scored, so now it is 20 to 14. A few plays later, Jake Thompson decides to run to the right side of the field to get a few yards, gets up, and starts to get in a little bit of an argument with one of the other players. Now being fourth and 17 while the clock is ticking down very fast, Matt Ryan decides to throw a pass to me downfield and I slightly drop it, I almost caught it, and sadly, we missed the field goal on fourth down. Now with time ticking down, and this could possibly be the last possession, Julio Jones makes an amazing catch that I thought was towards myself to get the first down and a little bit more. With a minute and 40 seconds left on the clock, we're at the 21 yard line, and your boy Jake Thompson gets a very clutch run and one of the best that we've had all day in terms of being clutch. And uh, at this point, we should be like keeping the clock going because I mean, we're for sure getting in. The next play, our boy Jakey Thompson decides to do a run to the left to get us inside the five yard line. The next play, we will line up as a wide receiver as Matt Ryan throws a pass down the middle and gets the touchdown. We are now up 21 20 with a minute left in the fourth quarter. The Bears will get it next and they actually failed to score anything so we barely squeeze out of this one at Soldier Field. It was honestly, uh, I don't know how to explain this game. I mean, we had 
about 14 rushes for like 80 yards which isn't too good but it's still it's our first game and i'm getting used to madden i'm so used to ncaa because ncaa and madden play completely different just like the running mechanics like it feels just fe it just feels weird when you when you're on the sticks just a little bit different so if you enjoyed the video press the like button subscribe if you're new and if you want to see more of this comment down below and that's all i got see ya So for the Falcons, they can breathe a sigh of relief as they're able to eke out the one-point victory here in the opener. And they'll return home next week to take on the Green Bay Packers. Meanwhile, for Chicago, they obviously fall to 0-1 with the defeat. And they'll try to get back on the beam next week as they'll head to Tampa to take on the Bucks. So that'll do it for us, for my partner, Charles Davis, and all the hard-working men and women on our crew. I'm Brandon Gaunt. You've been watching the NFL right here on EA Sports. That's all, folks.